Hey, it's Chelsea and welcome back to the Mad Cat Makings YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to be doing a crochet challenge to see how much I can make in a day. At first, I thought about doing the 24 hour challenge because I've seen a lot of YouTube videos of people doing that and I decided that I didn't think it would be the best idea. In a lot of the videos I watched, people said that their productivity really dropped off after a while and I didn't want it to mess up my sleep schedule, so I decided just to do how much I can crochet from the time I wake up until the time I go to sleep. So that's what today's video is going to be about, so stay tuned and let's see what I can make. So it's a little after 6 a.m. I woke up not too long ago and I got my coffee and I'm about to get ready to start crocheting. My plan for today is to start with some dinosaur snugglers and then make some of those uh, mini triceratops later on and just see how much I can get done. I have this burnout blanket yarn in the color terracotta so I'm going to start with that for a dinosaur snuggler and see where we get. body of the dino and this is what it's looking like so far it's around 7 30 right now so i'm gonna go wake up my husband for work and eat some breakfast and then i'll come back and finish the dino so i just finished the first dinosaur except for the spikes and now i'm going to make another one with this yellow yarn and then i'm going to do all the spikes at the end since i'm going to do them both in a cream color and that's what i'm going to work on right now for the dinosaur and then after I get all these done I'm gonna make another dinosaur with this yellow color and do the spikes for that one and then I will check back in when I have both of those done right now it's around 9 o'clock so it is around 10 30 and I just finished with the dinosaur snugglers here is the one in the terracotta color and then this is the one in the burnt mustard color and it's both burnout blanket yarn and the pattern is by mama made minis and i'll link that below and now i'm just going to take a break and go outside for a few minutes and then i'll probably try to make some of the smaller dinosaurs and just go with the theme of dinosaurs for the rest of the day so i was going to sit outside and crochet for a little while but it is just way too hot so i am back inside and i have been working on these mini triceratops I used the rest of the burnt mustard color that I used for the dinosaur to make this one. I haven't added the horns yet, but this is what it looks like so far. And then I was going to use the rest of the terracotta color to make another one, but I ran out of yarn. I think I might have another skein of this yarn somewhere. I don't know. I'll have to look and see if I have some. But I was trying to use up like my scrap yarn and things that I don't have a lot of because I have this whole basket full of just small amounts of yarn and I can't even put the lid on it. So I need to use up some of this and I thought it would be good for the mini triceratops because that pattern does not use a lot of yarn. So that's what I'm gonna be working on for now. It's around noon time. So I'll check back in in a little while. <laughs>
of getting a little sidetracked when I was going through my scrap yarn and I had a lot of this bluish gray color and so I made another one of these dino snugglers and then I also finished up these mini triceratops and I did a pink one and then I also did this triceratops and with the scrap yarn and I really like the way this one turned out with all the different colors I think it looks really cute and now I think for the rest of the day I might just make more mini triceratops because they're pretty easy to make and I'm going to do a bunch of different colors and I will check back in later. Okay, so it has been a few hours since my last check-in and I am just hanging out with Penny on the couch. My husband just left to go catch some Pokeballs. So we're just gonna hang out and do some more crocheting. I have been working some more on the mini Triceratops. I've done this green one and this pink one and it kind of looks like a pig right now. But I think once I add the horns onto it, it will look more like a dinosaur and oh I got these new overalls today in the mail from Duluth and they have little mushrooms and flowers on them and I love them and so we're just going to be hanging out and crocheting and, and then tomorrow I will go over everything that I made today so I will see you then. So it is the next day and now I'm going to show you everything that I made yesterday. I ended up making three of these dino snugglers. I made one in this uh, mustard yellow color and then I made one that was a faded red color and then I made one that was this blue color. And then I made 12 of the mini triceratops. I made a red one and a pink one. And then I made one in this faded pink color. I still think this one kind of looks like a pig. And then I did a purple one and this yarn was is the um, plush yarn from Big Twist. So it's a little bit bigger than the other ones that I made. I made one in this faded yellow color and then I also made one in the mustard yellow color. I made an orange one with a yellow stripe because I didn't have enough yarn to do all orange. I made two teal triceratops and one blue one and one green one and then I made this one with a bunch of different colors that I think I showed that one yesterday. So I kind of have a little bit of a rainbow going on and I think it looks really cute and it will look really good on my display. I'm really glad I did the challenge this way instead of doing the 24 hour challenge. It didn't really disrupt my sleep schedule and I was still able to get a lot done. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.